Hi, we're going to be going over the parts and assembly of a 120-piece G2 display. Starting off with the hardware, we've got 32 1024 by 3 8 screws, two 6 by half screws, four 10 by 5 8 screws, six grid clips, two mirrors, one display top, 12 nose pieces, and two clear header protective panels. One divider panel, two grids, and two side panels. Now we're going to assemble the 120-piece G2 display. We'll start by taking our header, our clear header protective cover. This has protective coating on it, so make sure to peel that off. Before you install this, make sure to put your header graphics behind this. And go ahead and slot both of them in, like so. And take two of your 1024 by 38 screws. Using the holes in the back, go ahead and lock those in. You want to repeat that on the other grid, which we've done ahead of time, and now we can go ahead and start installing our clips. Do this by taking all of them and putting them on one grid, that way they're easy to install onto the next one. Make sure to note the placement and make sure they line up with the tab like so. Go ahead and get your other grid and snap those together. Now that you have both grids clipped together, we're going to go ahead and do the rails. Make sure when placing them in, the orientation of them, make sure the hole for the mirror is facing upwards. One thing to note if you're installing this somewhere with low ceilings is that you may have to tilt the display, slot that into the clip, and just slot it into the two remaining ones. Now that we've got the side panels installed, we'll go ahead and we'll do the divider panel. Again, just like the headers, make sure that you peel the protective plastic off. You can go ahead and bend it, don't have to worry about sear sealing clearance. Just like the side panels, go ahead and drop it in and just make sure it lines up with the clips going down. Now that we've got that installed, we can go ahead and install the display top. Now that the top's installed, we can go ahead and install the mirrors. These have protective plastic on them, so make sure that's peeled off. The twin stick on the back, that will help adhere to the panel. Take two of your six by half screws and get those screws started, but do not tighten down all the way. Once you have that started, we'll go ahead and we'll peel the backing off the adhesive piece. Go ahead and make sure that's all lined up and parallel and stick it to the panel. After you've done that, you can tighten that top screw up. Go ahead and repeat that on the other side. Now that we've got all that installed, we can go ahead and set the display top onto the base. When picking this up to put this on there, remember that there's nothing holding the divider panel in, so make sure that you hold that when lifting it up. Once you've done that, go ahead and line up the holes. Go ahead and take your four 10 by 5 8 me screws. Once they're all tightened down, we can go ahead and put the final pieces, the nose pieces on. For these, we'll use the remaining 1024 by 38 screws to install. When putting them on, make sure the nose pieces are in the correct orientation so they hold the eyewear properly. And repeat that process for the rest of them.
And that's it. Once you've got all 12 nose pieces installed, your 120 piece G2 display is all done and ready for use.